Ancient Egypt was a land of learning, but their lifestyle and their food is also interesting, as our special Barncroft Primary School Year 5 apple pie will show. The ancient Egyptians lived along a narrow strip of land either side of the River Nile. Each year the land flooded, leaving it rich, fertile and ready to grow crops. The people highly valued their families. In poorer families, the mother looked after the children, but wealthy families had slaves to attend the children's daily needs. Young boys learned a trade from their fathers, and wealthy boys from the age of about seven went to school. Young girls learned from their mother, but wealthy girls were also educated and could read and write. Because Egypt is in Africa, but very close to West Asia, the food eaten in ancient Egypt was a mixture of the two. Most of their calories came from breads made from wheat and barley. This was often quite dry, so it was dipped in olive oil. But the wheat and barley also made soups and porridge that sometimes included a little fish. They did not eat a lot of meat, but the meat that the wealthy families did eat was mostly water, fowl and game. Poorer families occasionally ate duck or goose that could be also purchased from the butcher. For dessert, they liked to eat dates, figs and honey. But archaeologists have also found that they also grew all kinds of melons. So we've decided to cook some ancient Egyptian food for ourselves. We cut the crust off the bread and layered the bread with honey and sultanas before cooking it. The head and the tail were cut off the fish and the fish was cleaned, wrapped in silver foil and cooked. The bread was mixed together and left to rise, cut into small rolls and baked. Mmm, sausage. Yeah, it's been in the oven. I'm making it just in the bread. I didn't like fish until I tasted it the ancient Egyptian way. When we tried the ancient Egyptian bread, it was to die for. Pudding. Delicious. Well, there you have it. Tasty food the ancient Egyptian way. Back to the studio.